1876, Boss Tweed, leader of New York City's corrupt Tammany Hall political organization, is delivered to authorities in New York City after his capture in Spain and transport across the Atlantic Ocean by the American naval vessel USS Franklin. Tweed had escaped from jail in 1875 and fled overseas. In 1936, the first issue of influential weekly pictorial magazine Life is published, featuring a cover photo of Fort Peck Dam Spillway by photographer Margaret Bork White. The magazine's stated mission is to allow the American public, through photographs, quote, to see life, to see the world, to eyewitness great events, to be amazed, to be instructed. In 1979, Thomas McMahon, a member of the Irish Republican Army, is sentenced to life imprisonment for preparing and planting the bomb that killed Lord Lewis Mountbatten, a World War II hero and second cousin of Queen Elizabeth II. McMahon is released in 1998 under the terms of the Good Friday Agreement, the accord that brings an end to most of the violence of the Troubles in Northern Ireland. In 2002, John Harrington of the Chickasaw Nation becomes the first Native American in space as a crew member of the Space Shuttle Endeavor. During the mission, he performs three spacewalks, totaling 19 hours and 55 minutes, which are commemorated on the reverse side of the 2019 U.S. dollar coin. Up next is the answer to yesterday's quiz. In 2020, the first ever all-black crew officiates an NFL game during a Monday night football matchup between the Los Angeles Rams and the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. The seven-man unit is headed by referee Jerome Boger, a 17-year veteran NFL official. And now, it's time for our Today in History quiz. Over which state did hijacker D.B. Cooper parachute out of a commercial airliner? California, Oregon, Washington, or Idaho? Think you know the answer? Drop your guesses in the comments below. Find out if you're right tomorrow on Today in History.